The Jesus you may not know. Jesus is providing for us. At this very moment, Jesus is seated at the supreme place of authority. He isn't resting, he's reigning. Sometimes you might look around and wonder, what in the world is going on? No matter what's going on in this world, Almighty God has it all in his hands. Nothing is going to happen that Jesus doesn't let happen, or want to happen. He is in control. Jesus is praying for us. Luke chapter 22 verses 31 and 32, Jesus said, Simon, Simon, behold, Satan demanded to have you, that he might sift you like wheat, but I have prayed for you that your faith may not fail. Romans chapter 8 verse 34, Who is he to condemn? It is Christ who died, and furthermore is also risen, who is even at the right hand of God, who also makes intercessions for us. Hebrews chapter 7 verse 25, he is able to save to the uttermost those who draw near to God through him, since he always lives to make intercession for them. Whatever is going on in your life, Jesus is praying for you. Jesus is protecting us. Jude verses 24 and 25, Now to him who is able to keep you from stumbling and to present you blameless before the presence of his glory with great joy, to the only God, our Savior, through Jesus Christ our Lord, be glory majesty, dominion, and authority, before all time, and now and forever. Amen. Jesus is preparing a place for us. John chapter 14 verses 2 and 3. Jesus said, In my Father's house are many mansions, if it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself that where I am, there ye may be also. Jesus is in heaven preparing a place for those who have accepted him as their Savior, and one day we will live with him for eternity. The Bible tells us that. The Bible teaches that. Say, yes, to Jesus. Making Jesus Christ the Lord of your life will be the absolute best decision you can make. Romans chapter 6 verse 23, For the wages of sin is death but the free gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord.